Okay, in the previous problem, we calculated um, the cell potential, the voltage for this. We got a positive 0.43 volts. We want to know, since this is a reaction that could be at equilibrium, and there shouldn't, should be an energy component to this, what is delta G for this reaction? The equation for this is delta G equals negative N F E sub cell. Well, E sub cell we just solved for is 0.43, and a volt could be visualized as a joule per coulomb. Okay, coulombs are a complicated unit that has to do with electrical potential. Um, has to do with like the energy of an electron traveling. Honestly, all that really matters is that F is Faraday's constant. So I'm just gonna go ahead and write the values in here. This is 0.43. This is Faraday's constant, which is 96,485 coulombs per mole of electron. And N is the number of electrons. So if we looked at these previous reactions, if you looked at the balanced equations on the, um, the chart up here, the cobalt reaction had two electrons and the copper electron or ele copper reaction had one. And this is like when we were balancing redox reactions, we need to find the least common multiple between those two. So the least common multiple between one and two is two. So N is two moles of electrons. So I didn't write this very nicely, but essentially we're just multiplying all three of those numbers together. So, there is a negative sign in the front. See this over here, it's kind of clear. So, minus two times 96,485, so we're gonna get a pretty big number here, times 0.43. Okay, so we got a huge number. So delta G at standard conditions equals negative eight two nine seven seven point one units here if we visualize this as joules per coulomb and this is coulombs per mole and this is moles the moles will cancel out the coulombs will cancel out and we'll end up with joules uh sig figs we basically only get two so this would round to and we can convert this to kilojoules this would be negative 83 kilojoules as the delta g which means, because delta G is negative, this should be spontaneous. So this is all related to the last chapter stuff as well.